If you're in a convertible and you're stuck on the freeway, you That'd get a nice, tan yeah. in the daytime, right? Yes. You know, I got up early this morning and I called Pat because the sunrise this morning was so spectacular and I called you to take a look at it and it was cool, wasn't it? <laughs> I didn't answer my phone. <laughs> You guys are both lying. <laughs> I was the one up early. <laughs> I should have yes. called you both. <laughs> uh, I did see the sunrise. It was gorgeous. I went out to the Northern Trust yeah. uh, Open at Riviera. It was beautiful out there. It looked beautiful. Yeah, it was yeah. so gorgeous. It was cold. It looked too. beautiful at 11 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> it was a little chilly at 7 a.m. when I was there. Uh, Which, but no, um, now that I know you guys get up so early, see, I'm going to call you. Don't you love how I said that too? Yeah. Yes, I got up and I called Pat. <laughs> well, it's funny. Funny that he knew that it was a beautiful sunset because um, I was I half no asleep idea. or a sunrise and I could see mm -hmm. it coming up. You look wide awake, Jackie. Yeah, you oh, do. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, happy Friday, everyone. Let's take it live outside right now. We've got sky too over the San Gabriel uh, Mountains right now. Oh, it just looks gorgeous and it was a beautiful day. Temperatures right where they should be this time of year. So, a lot of folks saying it's cool out there, but again, those are average temperatures. Uh, if you're heading to the beach, well, you will enjoy it this week. And we do have some gradual warming. Next work week will be perfect beach weather. We still have some high surf advisories to get to. Uh, so we are looking at the high surf advisories just till 9 p.m. tonight. After that, that will start to die down. But I'm talking about temperatures, where they should be for this time of year finally. It was 69 today downtown. That is the average high for this time of year. And it's still pretty comfortable outside this evening. Look at these temperatures 65 in Van Nuys. 67 in Ontario, 66 in Fullerton, heading closer to the coast, 50s now in Oxnard. So definitely a cool evening in Oxnard with winds at around 10 miles an hour. Now notice it's getting a little bit breezy and the winds are coming in out of the west. That will continue to be the case overnight tonight through tomorrow. And that's why temperatures have been a bit on the cool side as far as what we've been dealing with. And that's the reason because we've got this trough of low pressure to our north. Uh, so it won't be moving through our area, but as it moves to our north, we've shifted to that onshore flow. And that's what is bringing in some cooler air. So that will stay to our north. Eventually a blocking ridge of high pressure is slowly going to nudge in from the south and west and that's going to keep the second trough of low pressure to our north and as this uh, ridge of high pressure builds in will eventually shift to the northeast flow which is the Santa Ana wind which is why we've got a big warm up next week. I expect us to have more record highs as soon as next work week but this weekend will be nice and pleasant if you are heading out to Riviera. All right mostly clear skies for tonight breezy and chilly out there overnight lows 40s to low 50s West winds at 15 miles an hour. Weekend forecast looking fantastic. Highs into the 60s at the beaches tomorrow. If you're inland or in the valleys, temperatures into the mid to lower 70s. Uh, by Sunday, 70s and 80s. Sunday is just going to be an absolutely gorgeous day, Ooh. but not so gorgeous by Monday. 90 inland out of the valleys and those warm temperatures. Uh, the warmest days will be Monday and Tuesday. I think we're going to have some record heat then, and then we'll gradually cool it down a few degrees. But these are temperatures still well above average yeah. and dry into the next seven days. Yeah. We just kind of skipped or had a short, a brief winter. I know. I think we'll, we'll definitely get some more wet weather before it's all said and done, but not in the next week. Well, let's hope so. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>